Candace, and this is my client, Mrs. Rosa, and I'm here to show you the proper way to twist hair. Now, with twisting hair, you're going to need a couple utensils, starting with your rat tail comb, which is for parting or for shorter hair. Then we have our natural comb, which is for longer hair or coarser hair. Last but not least, our twisty comb that it gets us our twists. Now you also would need gel. Depending on your client or your client's hair, you can use the olive oil clear gel, which is non-flaky, or you can use our black gel. It could be Echo Style or Softy, whichever one prefers your needs or your client's needs. Okay, now we're gonna just jump right on in. Miss Rosa, will you hand me the twisty comb, please? Now, for majority of people that are not experienced. Mr. Mr. Which hand me the rat tail comb. You may want to use the rat tail comb, which is to part the hair so you can see the scalp before you twist. Then you'll take the twisty comb. Once you parted the hair, comb the hair out so that it's not curling back up, and then you're just going to twist to the right. While you're twisting, the hair will start locking, meaning getting tighter, and you're going to go slightly down as you're twisting. You may have to grab it just now and then, but for me, I don't really have to do that. I just go in. And with that, it's a long proper twisting. Okay, now you guys, we're going to do a close-up of one just to show you how to get down to it. You're going to part the hair. And just begin twisting counterclockwise in a slight downward rotation. Okay guys, here's another one for you. And don't worry about the gel, once it dries, the gel will, won't show it all. Okay guys, now I'm going to finish my client up and go off camera and come back with the finishing result. Okay, now we're at the final result. Um, what you would need to do is some type of spritz. Ms. Rosa, could you pass me those spritz please? To spray on the hair just to make sure it gives it a nice hold. It doesn't have to be a hard hold and you don't have to use a lot, just enough to cover the hair. Then you use an oil chain or some type of shine. Can you ask me that, Mr. Royal? Ms. Royal, not the Royal. And that makes the hair shine. Then after that, you'll sit up under the dryer for about 20 to 30 minutes and you'll be all right. Wow, isn't she beautiful? Now, if you want your hair done like this, you can reach me at my Facebook page at Candace Wilkins at Facebook or www.hyosaproductions.com. Thank you.